always tracking, always alerting. This is Storm Team 8. Nice picture of sunset over in Muskegon. Each day now, the sun sets just a little bit farther to the north, and the days get a little bit longer at the rate of about two and a half minutes per day. Sunset now is after 8.30 in the evening. Breezy, warm, and dry night tonight. Some scattered showers and storms for the day tomorrow. I have the chance of rain in any one spot at 80%, so most everybody will see some rain. Cooler pattern, well, it cools off a touch tomorrow because we'll have the clouds and the rain, but the real cool air starts to come in on Monday, and it'll be with us for uh, most of the next couple of weeks. Nothing much on Storm Track Live now. The rain's been off to our west. Thunder showers weakening in Iowa after producing several tornadoes and reports of large hail and damaging winds. And look at the snow going on yet in the Dakotas. Boy, have they had a snowy month. Some places out there have picked up over three feet of snow just in the month of April, more than they had in January. This is uh, the marginal severe weather risk for tomorrow. It covers all of lower Michigan, a small part of uh, upper Michigan and adjacent areas of Ohio, Indiana, and Illinois. In this area, that's just a low or marginal risk. And uh, the greatest threat would be just some isolated strong winds with a few of the thunderstorms coming on through. Uh, here's our future cast, the showers out over Lake Michigan here at daybreak, and then they start to come inland over the area. This is at 9 a.m. in the morning. It's already raining in the Muskegon area in Holland. The rain is into Grand Rapids around 12 o'clock. I think the combination of the rain and the clouds will hold temperatures down a little bit, keep us from getting too terribly unstable, so that may prevent us from getting uh, storms, but the most likely area to see a strong wind gust would be down toward Coldwater, Battle Creek area, and Jackson. Uh, the rain pretty much uh, exits the area during the day on Monday. A shower could sneak up to around Hillsdale, but most of us will stay dry. More clouds than that, but some breaks in the clouds as we get into Monday and Tuesday. Low temperatures overnight tonight, well, not very low, only down to the low 60s. That's what high temperatures are supposed to be like. Temperatures tomorrow, 72 Grand Rapids, 76 Battle Creek, only 64 on the beach at Muskegon, so a much cooler day there with the wind southwest off the water. Here's a look at your forecast, 72 tomorrow, a few scattered showers and storms. A few of them could produce some brief heavy rain and some gusty winds. Chance of rain is only 20% Monday. We could see a sprinkle or flurry on Tuesday as the cool air settles on in. Nothing warm after this weekend. As you can see, temperatures settle down into the 50s later this week. Could be a random shower next weekend, but those should be few and far between.